What's going on guys? It is Eddie from EB Fitness. Welcome to the video. Today, I am at the Coons dealership with Bedhead. Because uh, it's pretty good lighting here. And lighting in my car sucks. I literally parked over there in the Coons dealership and that's probably not allowed. But I don't think anyone's here. Um, anyways, today is Tuesday. It's deadlift day. I'm going for a PR. I'm gonna try to pull 300 pounds today. Oh, and I wanna take you guys with me. It's been, it's been rough the past few weeks, but uh, just lifting in, in general has been really rough. So let's see how it's gonna go. Let's do it. Um, that's all I gotta say. And yeah, gotta get my car back. Hey guys, this video is so overdue. It is so, so overdue. This is the, like, the, like, before you, you finish your bulk, you go for a bunch of PRs, because, like, you're cutting, and once you're cutting, you can't really hit huge weights again. So this is what this video is. It's basically the deadlift version of that. Um, and it's the only footage I have for all my PRs, which is a mess, man. And Road to 300, quick update on Road to 300. Dude, I don't know what I'm going to do about this, because now I'm cutting. So that seems to be a very, like, thing that happens a bunch where I, like, I cut, or I make, not like, I make a series and then I just can't follow through with that series, but, um, I don't know, man. You know, I'm just, uh, like, honestly, like, everyone, I just want to kind of vent right now, because I haven't made a video in a long time, I can't, I haven't really vented in a while, but, like, you know, like, everyone in, like, the fitness industry and, like, Instagram and all this stuff, they have all these things where, like, everything is, like, super happy and good, and, like, the gym is always amazing, and, like, they're always rocking it, and it's sick, dude, it's sick. But you know, man, like, it's not true, dude. Like, sometimes the gym just sucks. And, like, I used to be so driven. And, like, that's, it kind of annoys me. Like, I feel like when I lost those, like, 100 pounds, I was so driven. It was insane. Like, I would get up in the winter and walk, like, a mile and a half in, like, triple layer jackets, double pants. Like, it was insane. It was insane. And I did that, like, so much. Um, actually, before I start ranting like crazy, I just want to say this is, a uh, like, yeah, deadlift footage, uh, bench press, or not, <laughs> to the footage PR, this is a 285, I go 285, then I go for 300, um, so yeah, um, yes, so, uh, yeah, but like, I was, I was so driven, and then afterwards, I lost 100 pounds, uh, 285 right here, I lost 100 pounds, like, the doctors gotta check you out, man, they gotta make sure that you're okay, like, mentally, cause you lost 100 pounds, right, they gotta check you out, and, uh, I, I was kind of, uh, like, seen as it was wrong for me to be, be so driven and I know I was driven more driven than people like on average um, and I was okay with that I was really happy with that but um, it was seen as a negative the fact that I was driven so much and they saw my relationship with the gym as a negative but I saw it as a positive I loved the gym and I still do love the gym it's so much fun to me uh, I'm loading the way right here for 300 um, and but you know, like, uh, I don't know, guys. Like, it went to my head, and I know it's not true, and I love the gym. I, I, I want to become driven again like I used to be. But something in my mind just is stopping me. I'm not as driven as I used to be. And I hate to say that, but it's the truth. And I want to let you guys know, man, because if you're into fitness, if you're trying to lose weight, you're trying to get stronger... It's not always going to be good. It's not always going to be the best time of your life. you got to push through. You have to push through so you can achieve what you want later and be happy later. Just got to think about that, man. So I'm going to make these videos. It's funny. It's like I'm talking to it's like I'm talking to like people who are watching my videos. But honestly, I'm just talking to myself. Like a lot of things I say, I try to say to myself. But yeah. And like one more thing. Like last thing. Um, like... Ah, this this whole video is supposed to be focused on just PRs and, and all that junk, but like something about it, man. I just want to vent. Like, I, since I'm driving to the gym now, I get to the gym so fast. Before it would take me like 30 minutes to get to the gym, and I would just talk, talk to myself, think about life, and these small little ideas in my life, and think about same things that are affecting me would just transform into huge ideas, and just drove like I was so driven from these ideas. Here's 300. Look at my hair, it's a mess. 300. Let's go. Yeah, baby. You know what's funny? I still remember when I held that weight at the top, I held it for a few seconds. I felt like I held it for like a long time. It felt like I held it for like like five seconds plus. What? 
What is this? Double footage. What the heck is going on? Hold on. Hold on. Three plates. What is this? Is this 315? Oh my god. That is 315, guys. 315. So, a little background. Got to put the mic away from my face. I'm getting a little too loud. So, the, the week... This is a week after I hit 300 pounds. So I hit 300 pounds. A week later, I hit... This is 315. I'm attempting 315. I was feeling good. I was feeling good that day. It was a week later. I'm like, you know, you're not supposed to go for two PRs in one week. Your CNS, your central, central nervous system or CNS is freaking out. But I was like, you know what, dude? I am feeling it right now. I'm in my Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle shirt, and I'm feeling it. And I'm going to rip it. Come on, baby. Let's see. PR. <laughs> Boom, baby. We got it. 315. That's how we end the bulk. That is how you end the bulk. 315. Um, not super crazy or super good compared to other people, but, like, compared to me, man, you got to focus on yourself, dude. And that was sick for me. I'm, I'm very happy with that. Uh, the video's going to go black probably now. But trust me, I'm still going to be here. But, yeah, guys, like, I'm, like, there was a lot of that footage that was just, like, me just standing there and, like, looking around and stuff. But... When you're deadlifting, man, you have to get... Like, I, I try to chop up my videos and speed up and get rid of the loose fill and all this loose time and stuff like that. But a lot of the time when you're deadlifting, you got to get your mind right. Got to get your mind right. Go for it and absolutely kill it. Hoping you guys enjoyed the video. Hoping you enjoyed this black screen. It's pretty beast, right? Until next time, this has been Eddie from EV Fitness. Hopefully, I will upload more <laughs> because it's pretty fun to upload, man. I got to tell you, it's pretty fun. And, um, oh yeah, I don't have a beard anymore, so, uh -huh. and I'll see you next time, guys. Take it easy.